Today we present Butch Hansen. He was sent to us by a female a while back who saw him claim to be a Green Beret online. One of our investigators reached out to him and he did indeed claim to be with Fifth Group. And after some dialogue and questioning, he came clean, yet said his second wife was the one that sewed the patches on his vest and he didn't have the heart to tell her that he wasn't a Green Bray, so he just started living the lie. Yet when we called him, he had a different story that he started claiming to be a Green Bray or something out of respect and honor. Yet that, that's not how you do it. So here's the uh, phone call between us and Butch. And afterwards, you could go to our website and check out his records. It looks like he went AWOL and was assigned to a personnel control facility for a while and got reduced in rank from a specialist to an E1. And you could also check out the other fakes, frauds, and phonies we have on our website. All right, out here. How long have you been uh, claiming special forces? A couple years or when did that start? A couple years. Yep. It started a couple, uh, two or three years ago. Maybe, I don't remember the exact date, but about two or three years ago, four years ago. I tried to delete all of the pictures. Who had this case? Was it Brian? Yes. Yeah. I guess we'll I just... Sent, I, I, sent, I, sent all my, I sent all my messages on Open Messenger and on Facebook to him. And I was trying to get caught up. I'm working like eight or nine cases as we speak, and they're all the same to me. Cases? I'm not sure I, I'm not sure I understand. Are you an attorney? Are you a lawyer? No. Were you claiming to be like right. a, a special forces medic, or what were you telling people? But I had just served in special forces. Yeah, I think you actually. I didn't, go into, I didn't go into. I didn't go into a lot of fancy stories. I didn't go into a lot of fancy stuff. I wore my medical patch, yeah. um, and stuff like that. And um, and you know how it is when you lie to people. The easiest way to lie to them is to not lie. Is just let them make assumptions. Yeah, you actually claimed a specific ODA though, didn't you? Yes. Okay. Well, one time, and that was to Brian. I never really said anything to anybody else about it. Well, I will uh, finish up this, and we'll go from there. I appreciate you at, uh, admit. No, what, what, ha what, what happens? What happens with this phone conversation and this information? I mean, what are you doing with it? You you could search us. There's no need to. Okay. You know, we post what was out there, and then what was said, and what and the truth that we found out, and then uh, we move on. Well, because I've had. People who have, have, have looked at your site have contacted me and, and, and made not threats, not anything, but just said, you know, uh, they basically just low, very low level harassment. One guy in particular yeah. said he was going to make sure that this doesn't get forgotten type of thing. We strictly share what we know and we move on. I, I'm gonna. Now, I can understand if you. I can understand if you get somebody who you've done this with, and you've done something like this, and they, whatever, and then six months later or a year later or whatever, whatever, yeah. they're doing the same thing again. Yeah. You know, there's a guy that owns Warlord Beard Oil Company. He's actually made his business off the lie that he was a Green Beret, and he told his part. Yeah, he well, if, you, if you look. Oh, go ahead. You're finished. You're well, finished. I mean, he told his partner that he thought it was going to blow over. And, you know, <laughs> that's when we step up and say, no, it's absolutely not going to blow over because you made your entire business off a lie. We'll just uh, post what we know and move on. You admitted that you were wrong. You deleted the posts. And I even told Brian, I said, if you want to, you know, he, he, he has openly looked into my Facebook page. I yep. got him. Um, set so he can openly look in my Facebook page if he desires to. Yep, yep. Admission, deletion of the claims, and uh, not ever reposting the claims. That's a big deal. So, right. yep. And, I, and, 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 and that's fine. I, I, I've stepped forward and I've done that. Now, technically, um, I yeah, I, I've stepped up and I've done that and, I, and that. And and my thing is, is I hope you're not recording this. I hope you guys are being honest with me. Uh, well, um, now, wait a minute. I've never said I wasn't recording it. But I am totally honest with you saying that 
we, we don't ask people to harass you and everything. But I've never once. Right, I understand. But I, I never said I wasn't recording this. You, 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 neither, neither, neither did you. Neither did you meet the expectation of, of starting a conversation with. Do you mind if I record this? I live in a one-party consent state where we don't have to. Right. Well, you know, I, 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 I understand. I understand what yeah. one-party consent is. Yeah. I'm just saying is that, um, you know, one of the quote-unquote big issues. It's supposed to be your honor. Okay? Yep. I admitted violating mine. I, I admitted violating mine, and I took the stuff down. Um, and now, I'm, I'm, I, am, I, I am questioning, and I'm, I'm, not question, I'm not questioning your honor. What I'm questioning is, is the veracity of statements like, we're not going to harass you anymore, we're not going to see our posts on Facebook about you, you're not going to see, you know, advertisements with your name in them. I well, and now, stuff like that. but I, I, I've never said any of that. I said we're not going to harass you. Okay, so you're going to continue to post stuff on Facebook. What's up on Facebook will probably stay on Facebook. That's why I asked you if you've seen our forum because there's a thread on you now, and it would only be who of us showing that we did our due diligence. That not only did we find out that you were not a Green Beret, but that you came forward and admitted it. So that text that you sent Brian admitting to it would only do you and us both good. It shows that you came forward and admitted you weren't one and came clean. I think that does you justice as much us saying we you know, cleared the case and moved on. Right, I understand what you're saying. Yeah. Well, and and that's probably where we'll head with this. And where and and, 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 and where else where else is this? I mean, I'm I'm expecting. I mean, you guys are expecting um, me to do the right thing. You're expecting me to be honest, and I'm expecting the same thing from you. Well, okay? I, and where else is this going to be posted besides on your site? Where else is it? Where else am I going to be finding this coming up into my life again? Well, three months, six months, a year. Probably just the way the internet is now. We work side by side with Stolen Valor, This Ain't Hell, and Military Phonies. So when they see stuff, they're probably more, they're, they're probably likely to share it in theirs. Hmm. Okay. I mean, you, you guys are going to do what you're going to do. And, 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 there, and there's no stopping you. Um, I just, uh, you know, one of the reasons why I went the route I went and did what I did is because um, of the high esteem and high honor in which these guys are viewed, which you guys are viewed, okay? Um, and, 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 and if this keeps playing a, a, a circuit pop up up here after, we've, after I've heard things like, you know, it's over and done, and it, it's 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 put to rest. Um, that's not what put to rest means to me, and it's not what put to rest means to you either. And so, at some point, I I I, I wonder when I have to question your veracity and honor. Do you understand what I'm saying? Well, I t I told you that it, it's already posted in our forum. Okay, I told. I understand you, that. And all we're doing is posting the facts. Uh, we never ask people to harass. If somebody starts harassing you on Facebook, report it. You know, that's not something I'm we... Just, I'm just saying, at, at some point, lay the rest means this is something that doesn't keep coming back up, and, and I keep having to answer this to my friends. I had to sit down with my friends last night while I was at work and several other people and say, hey, this is what happened, this is what occurred, this is what they were doing, this is what I did, I was wrong. Well, wait a minute, okay. not, not what they were doing, we didn't do anything except right or wrong. Well, I, I didn't say what you were doing was right or wrong. What I said, this is what, what this is what they did. Oh yeah, they 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 they, they, they did this. They did they, they vetted this. This is the information that they got out that they got it got, and this is what's going on. This is what I did, I know. and it was wrong. Yep, okay? Under, understood. But I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want this to keep coming up every three to six months between me and my friends. Yeah, or between me and any other 
uh, people that I have to associate with. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, we don't, we I don't, mean, we don't go out of our way. I, I made it fairly clear. I'm, I, well, you, know, you, you keep dancing around making commitments to things like, you know, we're going to be honorable and virtuous in this, and we're going to not, and we're going to not try to make sure that, you know, you're any more humiliated than you already are. Okay? Yeah. Um, you, you, you keep dancing around that with, with your, your verbiage and, and the way that you want to say and do things. And no, I'm, I'm that, only, I'm only, I'm talking to you in a straight, I'm talking to you straightforward and in open and honest language. Well, and, and you're, and you're doing a verbal dance with me. Um, I'm serious. If you're not an attorney, you ought to be because you're very good at it. Well, that's, um, and I'm, I'm not, I'm not being angry at you. Yeah. You have, you, you have the moral high ground in this issue at this time. Well, I'm trying to explain to you. And what I told you is we'll prop, we'll do a follow up and, and add your admission. And you and I agree that's only does you good. It shows you came clean. And then it's pretty much, we're pretty much, that that's what we do. You could look back five years worth of cases. There's cases five years old. We don't keep bringing them up and rehashing them. All right. Now I, understand, I understand what you're saying. All right. I'm not talking about that. What I'm talking about is, you know, it sounds to me like you're, you're, you're sidestepping an issue so that you can post something on Facebook and put it out there again, re re bringing this up and refreshing this whole thing and tearing the scab off the wound, so to speak. Okay? Well, I, I, um, and, but, and, and then, and you can say, well, you know what, this is his admission and we're posting this because with, with, with and he knows that we're posting this because we've told him we're going to post this and we're going to do this and we're going to do that. And, and we're going to keep this out there for people to constantly be aware of my friends, uh, my professional, um, circle here where I live yeah. has has already determined that um, that they've made their judgment on this and, and I've got a couple of friends who tried to defend me and I told them please stop, don't don't talk, don't don't assault these people, don't insult them, don't don't you know, send them stuff. What they're doing is perfectly valid. Um, and and that's fine. Exposing somebody and saying, Hey, come clean, hey, take your stuff down, hey, be honest about this that's one thing. To continue to post it just to humiliate them, that seems beneath you guys to me. Well, I mean, it's not something that we continue to do. It's something that's done and will always be out there. Once once something's on the internet, it's on the internet forever. So I it's, know. Once, once something is posted, it's posted forever. Yeah. So what I'm saying is there was there is no need for you guys specifically to be posting anything or to be bringing it to anyone's attention to request that they post it or to be making sure that they're aware that they can post it yeah. or anything else. Well, they have... I mean, they have yeah, I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to protect myself a little bit here. You know what? Yeah. I just had a very humiliating experience. I just had a very humiliating experience in front of friends and relatives. And, um, and, and, and to a degree, I had that coming. I, I deserved that for well, what I did. Yeah, more okay. than a degree, though. What's that? It's you said to a degree, but it's you know. No, it, I, I, what, I, what I mean, it's, I, I had it coming. Right. I, but, I, well, I, there you go. To a degree, I mean, it needs to end at some point. Well, th there okay. you go. Yep. Hey, it, it needs to end at some point. I need. To, I need to at some point be given a reassurance that yes, we really, we really do actually mean laid to rest when we say laid to rest. Well, it, it, we're, we're really being honest and using proper the, the, the terminology that we need. We're not trying to be word tricksters here. We're not trying to dance around the truth. We're not trying to be, you know. Yeah. Um, and, 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 and I'm going to be honest with you, sir. I don't feel like that's where you're at right now. I think you're expecting me to be honest and me to complain and me to do things, but you're not being honest in what your, in what your, um, what your actions are going to be. I told you what our actions are. We will follow up on the thread. How much more are you guys going to be? How much more are you guys going to be posting? Well, I just told you we will follow up with your admission. That's only the right thing to do. We can't say, "Hey, you know this guy claimed to be a Green Bray. We know he wasn't. We talked to him, but we're not going to say what was said, and we're not going to show you that he, you know, admitted it." That's only fair to us, you know. That's that's shown we we 
accomplish what we were after. We got him to admit, and I guess you said you were sorry. I said I was. I said I was wrong. I said I'm sorry yep. that um, I made any false statement. That I made any false statements whatsoever. Well, and that is what we share. Hey, he apologized. He admitted it. He deleted the pictures, and right. But we're going to we're going to continue to make sure that this is out there as best we can. All right. I'm um, ob obviously at this point. We are going to accomplish nothing more, and I don't want to be frustrated, irritated, or angry at you for doing the right thing and doing your job. Right. Well, hey, I appreciate okay. your candor. But I, am be but, I am become but I am becoming frustrated and irritated because, like I said, I, I feel like you want to take the opportunity to... Um, do more than just unveil the truth. You want to take the, uh, the opportunity to humiliate a person after you've unveiled the truth. Don't even okay. go there. That's not true. We don't kick it to anybody when they're down. Well, that, I, I, I feel like I'm being kicked. I probably would be too because you're feeling a little bit ashamed. You, you're, but, you, but you know the thing about it, if we didn't out you tomorrow and the next day, you would have still been a Green Beret. None of, nobody that we've outed, nobody has come clean on their own. They only show remorse when they're caught. So, I mean, don't try and make us feel like the bad guys. I, I don't want you to feel like the bad right. guy. You're not the bad guy here. I know, but... You're the, so, guy, you're the guy. You're not the bad guy. You're the guy who did his job. I was the yeah. guy who did the wrong thing. Right. Okay? But, I'm just saying that I did the wrong thing. I apologized for it. Yeah. I went in and deleted everything that had to, that, that, that was associated with it, like you guys asked me to do. And then I keep getting messages from Brian asking for, well, one more thing, one more thing, one more thing. And then I get, well, you need to call this guy and talk to him, one more thing. And it's like, okay, guys, you know what? I'm doing everything I've done. I'm, I, I've met your requirements, and yet you keep going and adding one more thing we appreciate the apology and you coming clean. We're, we're probably going to add your admission to what's already out there. And that only makes you are look... You add, are, you, are, you add, are you adding it to your website and your thing? Or are you just posting it like all over the web, all over the, the internet? The only place we post it is pretty much our thing. What other people do with it is on them. It, that's not us. Right. And how much of the phone conversation is going to wind up on, on there? And if you and I agree to it, the only th real thing that's important is us agreeing that, yes, you did come forward, you did admit it, uh, you did step forward and delete your pictures, and you said it wasn't going to continue. You know what? Yeah. Here's the deal, sir. Um, you guys have not just the moral high ground, more, more than the moral high ground, you have the absolute right to do as you choose. Okay? Because of the fact that I was wrong. Yeah. Okay? Um, you have the absolute right to do as you choose. However, um, understanding that I think that one, on seeing my actions, two, on talking to me and listening to my voice, I think you can see and, 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 and get the feeling that I am being upfront, open, and honest about this. Yeah. So I, I'm, I, 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 like I said, you guys have the right to do with what you want. You have the right to whatever you need to do, whatever yeah. you feel you need to do. Yeah. All right? Yeah. I, I, think, I think that what? you are not a foolish man. I think that I, I I work with people. I actually do supervision at my work, and I work with people, and I know when I'm being jerked around and lied to, and I know when somebody is being honest I, up front with me. I, I don't sound like okay. I'm jerking you around, do I? No, you don't sound like I, did, I didn't say you were. Yeah. I said I deal with that at my work. Yeah. So I'm telling you, okay? Yep. Um, I have taken the steps that you guys have asked to take, and I will continue to take those steps. Yep. Anyone who comes to me and asks me and talks to me in a civil manner 
and with the respect that I deserve, at least as a human being, all right, I will be open and honest with them. I expect you guys to realize that maybe, just maybe, there's no point in destroying everything this guy's ever stood for. Right. All right, we'll get off the phone here. And like I said, I left my... I, Brian it has access to my webpage and to right. my Facebook. So at any time he needs to get on there and look at it, yep. all he's got to do is look. You go with the assumption that I'm going to make my upfront, honest, best efforts to do the right thing, and I'm going to go on your... I'm going to go on the faith that you two are going to do to be upfront, honest... And perhaps a little compassionate. Yeah. All right, man. All right, sir. All right, man. Out here. Be safe. Have a good evening. You too. Out here.